Actually, before I explain it about the atmosphere, our atmosphere, we can say that our Earth is have uh, so many uh, characteristics, and then in our solar system, the our Earth we can call the terrestrial planets. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello scientists, enthusiasts Nice to meet you again with me, Mr. Azil at Mimnu Pucang Post Podcast Pes Cihui Today we have a special quiz There are Mr. Widi and Mem Titin How are you today Mr. Widi and Mem Titin? Alhamdulillah fine Alhamdulillah I'm doing great Okay, I said a big thank you to the all our audience who have joining this our adventure scientist adventure. Today we have uh, we will discuss together about the layers of the Earth atmosphere. But before we ask and into the stratosphere of knowledge a quite short to the our listener thank for joining us of scientific adventure so mr widi let's we start about our journey in this morning okay thank you mr azil for today for the our episode we're talking about the our earth Actually, before I explain it about the atmosphere, our atmosphere, we can say that our Earth is have uh, so many uh, characteristics, and then in our solar system, the our Earth we can call the terrestrial planets. We can say terrestrial planet because of the terrestrial planet, uh, which had a characteristic rocky in this planet, and then the our Earth is number third in our solar system, and then we can say the our atmosphere is like a blanket of our Earth. The blanket is con- protecting us from the harmful out space or harmful the radiation of light, and then uh, our atmosphere we have a five layers. We can see troposphere, stratosphere, mesosphere, thermosphere, and then the outside is exosphere. Each layer has the own distinct characteristic and then has the main functions. Fantastic! So let's we enter the high upper. Add into the troposphere, the layer class of the earth surface and the stratosphere second layer, what make this layer special and the significant for our life in this earth? Okay, well, I want to explain about the first layer and the second layer. The first layer of uh, our atmosphere is troposphere. Troposphere is where the weather Uh, events occur. It's home of clouds, rains, and all uh, uh, and all the atmospheric phenomena we experience daily. And then uh, it's maturity of uh, Earth's air masses uh, concentrated. So in this layer. We know that a uh, water cycle happened, and then for the second layer is stratosphere. Stratosphere is the second layer or above the troposphere. In this layer, airplane fly, and then there is the ozone layer there that uh, protect us from the harmful of uh, sunlight rays. This one, uh, the rays is. UV, uh, UV sunlight. Uh, as human, we must keep part of it. We uh, decrease the global warming and then greenhouse effect that can make uh, ozone layer can be break. And then actually uh, the water cycle that happen in troposphere uh, will be run well if we can keep the balancing of our Earth. Okay, going higher up, we reach uh, the mesosphere. So, what the some phenomena we find in this area? 
Okay, for higher up, the next layer is there is a mesosphere. In this mesosphere, there is a phenomena we can see from from the our Earth in the land. Actually, in the mesosphere, uh, the protecting us from the out space of uh, things like a meteor, and then in the mesosphere will be burn up that meteor, and then we can see the shooting shooting star in this mesosphere, and then uh, some of the part of the our Earth we can see the unique phenomena uh, that is the aurora borealis but uh, not all the part of earth we can see this phenomena okay and now how how about the top of layer atmosphere okay the top of our layer atmosphere in the outer space we can uh, we can say this layer name is exosphere in this exosphere the satellite orbit Okay, well, what the amazing we had we have uh, our journey today with Scientist Week journey. Uh, we must to still and keep our Earth and and make this a truck at this atmosphere journey. Yeah. Uh, thank you for all of the viewers for your joining today in our science expedition. Okay, for additions, yeah, we can keep our ozone layer with uh, re to, uh, reduced to house of glass, and then we can uh, reduce to using fuel fossil in order our earth and our ozone layer keep still and then protecting us from the UV radiations and then global warming. Thank you very much. Okay, absolutely. Stay tuned for our next episode, where will the unfailing moth mysteries of the natural world. Until then, keep looking up and exploring the wonders that surround us. Okay, thank you very much. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.